Ah, good, you're awake. I feel dizzy. Nothing a week's worth of rest won't clear up. I don't have time for that. I have to find Armstrong. I must insist. Come on, you jetsies! You ain't even trained. Oh, hello, Kate. Armstrong. How'd you find me? Oh, that's right, you're a spy. Having a tough go of it? Well, it's eleven against one. Excuse me a moment. That's the spirit, lad. Ah! Make that twelve. I didn't see the one in the corner. What a minute. Take your time. Ah! Now I'm mad. All right. Now, what can I do for you? I need your help. Uh, I don't know. I've pretty much washed my hands of international intrigue. You owe me. Ah, don't start. All we're asking is that you help Kate infiltrate the India branch. Well, I suppose I could make a few calls. But don't expect me to get involved. Kamal, Magnus, I'm coming to India. have an appointment with Monsieur Volkov. Excuse me? I was sent for by Dimitri Volkov. I'm sorry, can you speak up? Take me to Volkov, now! Oh, Motel Lava, very nice. Wait here, please. Sir, the assassin has arrived. Send him in. I just want to say, monsieur, that it is an honor to stand in the presence of the legendary Dmitri Volkov. You are, without a doubt, the uh, Michelangelo of murder. Well, that's very kind of you. Monsieur Volkov, tell me who did this to you, and I shall exact terrible vengeance. It was a skiing accident. Oh, I see. Now then, you're probably wondering why I summoned one of the world's most dangerous contract killers on such short notice. Because you want me to kill someone? Not just someone. I want you to kill... Kate Archer. How do I convince them to hire me? Demonstrate your value to them. Maybe they need a maid. Maybe you need your ass kicked. We're being watched. Right. I'll stay here. You grab him and find out what he's after. My pleasure. Kemal sent me to meet you. Why didn't you introduce yourself? I thought I was being followed. Kamal is waiting for you. At the... I said grab him, not stab him. He was about to tell me where to meet Kamal. Not a problem. Kamal said he'd wear a pink carnation so you'd recognize him. Me? I can't afford to be seen. You dare! Right, I'll handle this. You look for Kamal. How will I find you? It's not like I blend in. It's a safe bet the police will be looking for you now that they think you killed Kamal's associate. Stay out of their way. What did they look like? The man was about six feet tall with a bushy red beard. Wearing a skirt. You mean a kilt? I don't know much about women's fashion. Anyway, 
The girl looked European with brown hair, an orange shirt, and striped pants. She was the one with the gun. But the victim was stabbed. Just arrest them. We'll sort out the details later. Yes, a man bought a pink carnation from me just a few minutes ago. Are you his friend? He dropped... Ah, there you are. I was beginning to worry. This map shows the location of Harm's hideout. I left a package for you in a newspaper box near there. Oh, before I forget, you probably need some money to get by Crazy Hariij. Fifty rupees should be enough. You may pass! To use your eavesdropping bug, simply fasten... 
If I catch you, <laughs> don't try to run from me. Someone to show you around? I've been around. Stop right there! You're That's under nice arrest, you. I tell you! Tony, what do you think? I'm speaking to. Who is this I am speaking to? It is I. Balaji Malpani. Balaji, you idiot. It's me, Anoop. 
Oh, I was wondering if that was you, my good friend. How are you? Fine, thank you. So, what is the password for today? Have you thought of something? I have. And I think you'll like it very much. Don't keep me in suspense. Okay. The password for the day is... Are you ready? Spit it out, monkey brains. Molligatani. What do you think? I think I should feed you two ferocious weasels. I'll tell you what the password is. It's Balaji Mapani. Better shape up or he's going to die a very slow, painful death. Got that? Goodbye. Someone was murdered near here. Password. <laughs> 